So today we're gonna to be unboxing, reviewing, and showing you everything that you need to know about this LaFont robot vacuum cleaner here. The company did send me this for this review, but I'm gonna be going through and giving you my honest opinion on this, putting it through the test. Um, I have lots of hardwood floor uh, throughout my uh, kitchen and office here, so I'm excited to go through and see what this thing can actually do. I'm gonna go through and unbox it, show you what that looks like. It comes in a nice little box as a user manual right here. And then you can see here, is the actual machine. Let me go through and put this down a little bit there. Um, you can see we have the actual machine here. Uh, it's pretty pretty small, which is nice, and fairly lightweight. It has a good um, uh, weight to it. You can see this is what it looks like closer here. It looks like it has some instructions, uh, nice kind of grippy wheels, and a, a wheel that kind of goes through and turns all different directions there. So that's the actual uh, main machine, of course. And then here we have, I'm assuming these are like the cleaners that you can go through and attach to it. Uh, there's lots of, there's like, looks like four of them there. And then here it looks like is the kind of docking station where this thing can go through and charge itself up. So, uh, and then it has a little block where you can go through and attach that too. So I'm going to go through and get this thing all set up. Oh, and it looks like uh, maybe a filter there um, is that. And then it has like a little cleaner as well. So I'm going to go through and get this thing all set up. I believe it does come with an app. So I'm going to go through and download the app and uh, kind of walk through that process. And uh, we'll get this thing all running here. Okay, so I now have actually been using this thing for about a week, and I have to say I am very impressed. I want to go through and show you some of the features that I found very helpful, some of the things that I've noticed with this thing. Some of the things that I was worried about is like these chairs right here, going through these chairs and getting into places. It had absolutely no problem with that. I'll show you that in a minute. Getting on and off the carpet had no problem. You can see I have a big area here of hardwood floor, and it was able to go through and navigate into all of these little cracks and uh, vacuum out different things. I got a couple of kids, and so they leave random toys and things like this in the walkway and it was able to, it says to pick those up as much as possible, but it was it was able to navigate around them as well. So um, let me show you things that I really like about this. So let me show you now how this thing actually works. So you can see right here, it comes with this little charger. When it's not um, when it's not working or when it's not actually going through and vacuuming, it will come back here and it will actually charge the device. The way that this works is it has this little um, metal things right here. It will go through and it will actually connect with those right there um, onto the device. So you can see that indicates it's charging. And then when I come over here, you can see it is also charging. This has a 100% charge. Now, if I wanted to quickly go through and clean the house, I can just click clean here and it will go through and clean until I have it recalled or the battery runs out. Or if you wanted, what you can do is you can go through and set schedules and have it uh, you know, clean like once an hour or clean once a day. Uh, you could do manual controls on this thing. Um, and when you are cleaning as well, so let me go through and get this thing started. So if I hit clean here, you notice that it will come out and it will start using those little scrubbers there to push all of the debris and dirt into the vacuum. And you can see it will just go through and find all those different areas. Now, when it's going through and doing that, I can click on this and you can see it will start mapping out where it is going and what it is vacuuming basically. So you can kind of have an idea of the current area. Now you can see right here, there is the current operating mode. And right now I'm just having it do the entire area. So you can see it's a big area in my house that is just going through and vacuuming. Um, but if I wanted to change that, you can see there's the um, whole area, whole area random. So the whole area range is one that you can go through in a range that it will go through and find. Whole area random is where it will just go through and it will kind of just randomly clean wherever it's finding spots or different things like that. Or you have this other option, which is along the edges. So if I click on that, it will go through and it will clean along all of the edges of the house um, and anywhere where it kind of goes through and uh, finds a point. And so, so I can go through and hit along the area and switch it over to there as well. And you can see here is the area that it will go through and do. And it does it all automatically, which is incredible. And then the third thing is just spot focus. And this is actually probably one of my favorites. But you can see right here, we have the high chair and this always gets so dirty, so dirty. You can see there's just like stuff over here on the floor. So when I go through and I do the spot focus, it will just go through and it will find all of the different spots uh, to go through and do it. You can see how fast it responds to the app. So it was just going through and going and doing the edge cleaning there. But now it's just gonna go through and find any spots um, inside of the, the area. So it does just an incredible job at picking up anything and everything in its way. So let me show you now, after it's gone through and done its job, what the filter looks like on this thing and how to change that out. Okay, and once this thing has gone through and done some cleaning, you can see this is where you can actually go through and empty this out. It does mention to clean this uh, bin every three days or so, and you can see you can go through and unclick this. And this is, is look at all this that it went through and picked up. There is so much in there. And in order to empty it out, there's just this little tab right here that you can go through and unlock, and then you can see, look at all that, that it went through and vacuumed up on the floor. Um, super effective.